you guys have been in a lot of close games hmm. lately. Does, does that concern you at all? No, not necessarily. I mean, I think there's things that we got to pick up, and, you know, we've had some opportunities to make games not close. Um, but I think we just got to keep working and keep fixing up the little details, and I think we're going to have a, a breakout games pretty soon. You missed your guards. Is that been a, those guys are good in your offensive line? Mm -hmm. You've got yeah. some injuries there. Yeah, I mean, it, it's football. There's always going to be injuries all over the field. Um, but I think the guys that have come up, I think we have really good depth, and the guys that have come and replaced, and they've done a really good job. A lot of teams talk about um, closing out games with a four-minute offense. Do you, do you guys just talk about seven-minute offense? <laughs> <laughs> uh, not necessarily. I mean, we talk about just controlling the clock and um, controlling the, the tempo of play. And, uh, you know, when we come to those um, – those times and have that opportunity. We just got to execute. Um, when you say like opportunities to score, I mean obviously the last two games were really close, but you did have the ball for the last seven plus minutes, and mm -hmm. I think ran it out in, in the red zone. Yep. Is that is that what you mean by like not being as bothered by the fact that they were one score games or two point or three point games or whatever? Um, I mean, I think in those situations you got to control the clock and do what you have to do to be able to come out of the game with a victory. Um, and I think that we've handled those situations well. And, um, you know, we've made the plays when we needed to make the plays um, and converted on, you know, some third downs where we really needed to to, to secure the ball and continue to run out the clock. Um, so. And fourth downs. And fourth downs, no <laughs> doubt. You say the confidence level of this team is very high because yeah. execution is one that's mattered. Every yeah. Year been there. Yeah, I think so. I mean, I think the confidence level in, in all three phases of the game has been really good. Um, you know, we're definitely a confident team. We've, we've done a lot of things really well, um, and we've executed in those situations that we needed to execute. Um, but I think just continuing to progress and continuing to get better and coming out here and practice and working is, I think, just executing, you know, even those situations that, you know, we're ahead and um, just continuing to pile on. So I think that's what we're, what we're really trying to emphasize. In the last couple of games where you've had to run the clock out, you're probably running the ball. What does it say about Makai to be able to perform in those moments? Yeah. Um, he's done an unbelievable job. Um, you know, he's helped out a lot in the past game too, being able to run the ball effectively. Um, huge credit to our offensive line of, you know, in those situations where they probably know we're probably going to be running the ball, um, getting a good push and creating some lanes for Makai, and he does a great job of making plays. Um, you know, one thing that I say about him a lot is he doesn't take, he doesn't get negative plays. Um, you know, no matter if it's not necessarily schemed up right or blocked up right, he's always going to keep his feet moving, and uh, you know he doesn't get tackled by the first guy, and you know we'll get those extra two, three, four yards, which are really big. Fingers okay? Yeah, I'm all good. Was it like getting a chance to watch your sister play last night? Oh, uh, was the first time you've seen her play in college. No, not the first time I've seen her play. I've been to a, a couple of her games when she was at Columbia, but um, definitely really cool um, to have her here at Tulane and be able to you know just walk across campus and um, get to see her play here. So it was is a good time. It, is, it, is it hard just to sit and watch as opposed to obviously you're out there playing uh -huh. to, to sit in the stands and be a fan knowing there's nothing you can do to control the situation at all? Uh, no, it's kind of nice. It's kind of nice to, <laughs> to lay back every once in a while. Uh, it was really enjoyable um, just to be there with my mom um, and be able to watch my sister play. It was a good time. Seeing your bowl invite, did mm -hmm. feel good for you to go into your thoughts on that? Good yeah. Time. Um, you know, huge honor, um, extremely blessed to have that opportunity. Um, but, you know, that's just a, a credit, not, not just to me, but a, a credit to my teammates and everybody else around me who's helped me be successful and my coaching staff of putting me in you know, position to be successful. So, um, you know, I think it's, a, it's an honor to not just myself, but the, the whole team and the coaching staff. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I mean, it, it's it's tough to win football games. Um, you know, it's a it's a really good conference. We've played some really good teams. Um, you know, and just to be in the position that we're in, we just got to continue to get better and you know capitalize on all our opportunities and you know continue to you know have the one and zero mindset. Um, no matter who we play, no matter what we're preparing for, is you know come out here on our, our practice days and get better and you know control what we can control. You knew coming into the season you guys would have a target on your backs. Mm -hmm. How much has that knowledge helped you to maintain? Yeah, um, you know, I mean, that's just kind of how it goes when you have any level of success um, that, you know, everybody, you know, kind of wants to be the team to try to knock us off or whatnot. Um, and, you know, I think it's some teams that, you know, especially from an offensive standpoint, what defenses have done, um, you know, it's 
it's kind of funny when we watch the film and they do multiple things, um, you know, the, the games that they've played and then we prepare for that and then they come out and do something completely different every single week. <laughs> um, it just shows that, you know, teams, I feel like they feel like they have to, you know, do some different things to be successful. Um, but we just got to continue to, you know, prepare and, and be ready for everything. You just throw out the tape and play ball until you figure out what they're doing at that point? What was that? You just throw out the tape and just play ball until you figure out what they're doing at that point? Uh, I mean, to an extent. Um, you know, we still have our keys and have our rules on everything and my progressions and reads and the offensive line has their, their schemes and blocks and protections and all that kind of stuff. Um, but, you know, we got to stay true to what we're doing and, you know, control the controllable and not let, you know, the other teams dictate what we do. So, so how many weeks have you seen it? Like the, you come out and go, oh, that's completely different. Uh, it's been a large majority of them. <laughs> a lot of teams have, have done some different stuff on the defense based on what we've seen on film. It is a sign of respect, though, right? Yeah, definitely. I mean, I, I would say so. How would you say Jaquan has influenced uh, the passing game this year? And, and, and then on the flip side, if he's unable to go this week, mm -hmm. could you highlight just the other elements of the passing game that you, that you like? Yeah. Um, you know, Quan's done a really good job for us, you know, since he's been here. Um, he's very explosive. He's super fast. Um, he runs crisp routes. He can win one-on-one. -on -one. And I think, you know, one of the, the best parts of his game is, um, you know, getting the ball in his hands and letting him work in space. Um, so he's, he's multidimensional and helps us offense a lot. Um, but, you know, see how he's feeling. And, you know, like you said, if he's not able to go this week, which I'm not 100% sure with what's going on, um, I think he's doing all right. Um, you know, we got a lot of guys that can win and a lot of talent, a lot of speed on this team. So I think we'll be good. Any, any thoughts on getting a national TV game? I mean, I know it's later and it's, it's four weeks from now, but just oh. to have that opportunity. Yeah, I mean, you know, those, those are always cool, but, you know, that's something where We'll focus on down the road. We're just, you know, worried about this week and, you know, controlling what we can. Thank you. Thank you. All good. Thank you.